Okay, here's our cover. Lay out in front. Roll it back. This is if it's in a mooring. I have a rope on there. Quick release buckle. Simply grabs the eye. I made it look hard. Uh, J channel grabs the aluminum. Then we roll this to the back. Okay, to hook the back, um, simply grab this strap prefix loop around the cleat, both sides. Then we're going to tighten our ratchets. There's a clicking mechanism for when we have enough tension. Makes a click and it's on. Okay, we just uh, showed an install as you're in a mooring, but here's some helpful tips and hints for the front end. You do not have to put the air dam clips to the rub rail. You can leave them off and tucked up if it'll be a faster install. Um, you also may want to, if it's out of the water, install that later. All you have to do is wrap these around. Um, they attach to the structural rail that's underneath the facade. So there's a little piece of aluminum, um, structural aluminum, that's on the other side. It just clips to that. Um, we have the quick release buckles that attach the eye are important for the webbing geometry. Um, additional hook makes it easier to put on the cleat. Uh, it, it also holds the webbing out and keeps it um, uh, in the proper location as you install and walk the cover back over the bimini in the back. Okay, here's the back of the cover. Um, we have prefixed webbing lengths. Uh, they're not meant to be adjusted. It grabs the cleat. Um, we have neoprene sleeves, so when you're trailering, you want to make sure that your um, webbing doesn't come in contact with the paint. So you slide the neoprene sleeve to protect the paint from the webbing. It's important to note that this has the plastic ratchets. You want to click the plastic ratchet until you hear the click. There's a click that indicates when you have the proper tension on the, on the strap system. Another thing to note, is that you want to be sure that the, the cover is pulled down and not hung up on any of the ribs on the playpen and it's seated properly. Again, it's our objective 
to not have the webbing hit the paint. 